welcome to Cheryl's Home Cooking and today we're going to show you what's how I make my chicken strips. They're really good so let's get started. In my bowl I'll put a fourth of a teaspoon of red pepper, cayenne pepper, teaspoon of salt, teaspoon of pepper, mix it all together, I'll take a little over a pound of the chicken tenders, place them in my bowl, and just mix them all around. Now I'll place some saran wrap on top, place it back in my fridge. In my bowl I'll place one cup of flour, one teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of pepper. A fourth of a teaspoon of red pepper, cayenne pepper. A tablespoon of garlic salt. one egg I'll mix it all together to this I'll add in some water I have one cup of water but I'll add in a little at a time Make sure to mix it well. That's the rest of the cup, so that is one cup of water. Meanwhile, I have my chicken tenders in the fridge. That's mixed well. So I have some oil in my pan. I'm waiting for it to get hot. I took my chicken out of the fridge. I'll unwrap it. I have my batter off to the side. So while my oil is getting hot, I'll take a chicken tender drop it in the batter make sure to coat it good I'll check on my oil I'll take another chicken strip because I'm waiting for my oil to heat up it's not quite there place it in I'll take a couple more I'll place it in my oil. Let it drip a little bit. Place it in. I'll put three in there.
Now I'll continue on with the rest. I'll do four. Make sure to coat them well. I do have a plate here with paper towel. Once the chicken is ready, I'll flip it over, let it get nice and golden brown. Then, then when it's done, that's when I'll place it on my paper towel. golden brown. I'll add in another one. Smells good. The chicken is done. So I'll put it on my big towel. I'll flip them over. I'll place some more chicken strips in. Don't they look good? I'll see you guys next video. Bye-bye.